Howdy, Ulverick here. This recording is to get you acquainted with the layout of Friar and its services available. In the future I'll be removing all this faffing about as I have a habit of spending way too much time messing with loadout, him and hawing over crafting, and repeatedly forgetting just what an origami is weak to. The loadout screen allows you to switch easily between your different weapon parts and other miscellaneous parts as well. You can also modify your appearance from this tab. Appearance in combat has no bearing whatsoever, so you can wear whatever the heck you like. You can save your appearances for loadout. And here is the previous loadout that I had. You will be using this terminal a lot. You will also be talking to this lady a lot. Here's the shopkeeper for the fryer. It's a vending machine. You can buy consumable items. You can buy bullets if you somehow lost the ones that you came with. You can also buy basic equipment. The various parts for your god arc. And you can also buy clothing items. Most of the stuff you can just make on your own, except for the clothing items. So it's not really a big deal to buy anything from the store. The archive screen here allows you to see tutorials, movies, and music that you've already seen. You'll eventually enter those doors. Ah, I hear congratulations are in order on the results of your compatibility test. I'm glad of your success. Please, sit. This is the most peaceful location on Friar. I come here when I have free time to reflect. My apologies. I haven't properly introduced myself. My name is Julius Visconti. I serve as captain of the Blood Special Forces Unit, which you will soon be joining. Please, no need to be nervous. I'm rather looking forward to working with you. Well, I have some tasks to attend to. But feel free to tour, Friar, once you've gotten some rest. We'll speak again soon. I'm certain. The garden is the only spot on Friar away from that music in the main hall. Harrowing. One of the most crucial tasks in any conflict is to understand your surroundings. Take a look around. Good luck. 
looking. Now then, focus straight ahead. All right, your keen eyes work well enough. Next, to movement. There's two raised platforms there. Go ahead and climb them, if you will. Sometimes that difference in elevation can be the difference between victory and defeat in battle. Always be conscious of your stamina. Pushing too hard and losing your breath in battle could end in death. Let's get a quick warm-up in. Why don't you run around for a bit? You were so freaking super amazing out there today. You're a newbie, huh? I mean, new to this. Blood special force. You know what I mean. I'm Nana Kozuki, cadet second class. <laughs> I just got brought up too. It's so awesome to meet you. I sure do. <laughs> Who doesn't? Deliciousness is universal. A god eater's got to keep her strength up. Eating's just another form of training, right? Right. Oh, by the way, as a token of our newfound friendship... Ta-da! Sandwich! It's my mom's secret super special recipe. An amazing Odin sandwich! Give it a try. Bet you love it. Oops! Training starts any minute now. I almost totally zoned. Sandwiches are a blessing and a curse. Sorry, gotta run. See you soon! Oh, hey! I'll be really mad if you leave even a single crumb! So enjoy! <laughs> 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 